Princess Ema. Got a few friends there, so... Something wrong? Look around. Trouble brewing. Time we were on our way. Mm-hmm. I'll buy some provisions for the journey. Then we'll go. Geralt, we should stay out of it. Just this once. What happened to the lilies? Took them down. Took them down? To hang a golden sun there now? I cannot show Temerian colours. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fond of the Imperials? You Nilfgaard's whore! I'll let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. I don't know shit! They hang my sister, dragged her out the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition. That they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you fear it? If not for Annie, your child would have choked on its navel string. You owe your son to Let my sister attending to the birth. And you don't fear the gods' wrath. You don't fear it, you cunt! <laughs> Leave me be! Recognize this medallion? You know what it means. Back off. You all right? They say witches steal young'uns. That's true. What the Emperor promise you, freaks? Your own land? Like he did the elves once? Get out, all of you. We ain't going nowhere. And neither are you. They won't back down now. I can see that. It's over. Leave me be! Get away! See his face! God save us! Be gone. And don't ever come back. <laughs> so much for not getting involved. Come on, let's go. started. Excuses, excuses. You've not changed a bit. Y yen How? I received a report about a witcher who'd appeared in White Orchard. I knew it was you, looking for me. I might have waited until you found me, but... Well, you know me. Patience has never been my strong suit. It's... Good to see you, Geralt. I... I'd even embrace you. Were you not covered in blood? Sorry. I wasn't expecting to see you. To be honest, this isn't at all how I imagined we'd meet. How did you imagine it? You didn't imagine you'd have a Nilfgaardian escort. Don't get me wrong, Yennefer. I'm glad to see you. But I do think you owe us an explanation. And I shall provide it. In Vizima. Ready your horses. We can talk here. Some charming orchards nearby. In bloom, even. So you almost can't smell the corpses. A tempting proposition. Sadly, I must say no. You see, someone awaits you in Vizima. Someone who doesn't like to be kept waiting. Emperor Emir Var Emrys. Or, to those on more intimate terms with him, 
the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Doubt I number among that group, for as I remember, last time we saw each other, he wanted to kill me. Well, now he wishes to make you an offer. The kind one can't refuse. I didn't, though I could have. Fine. Guess I'm willing to hear him out. The Emperor of Nilfgaard, Lord of Metina, Ebbing, and Gamera, Sovereign of Nazare and Vicovaro, will feel honored, I'm sure. What about you? I'm going in the opposite direction. I somehow doubt the Emperor's invitation mentioned me. Besides, I've got things to do at Kaer remember? Yeah, I remember. Thanks for your help, Vesemir. See you soon. How's your horse? Swift? Can't complain. Why do you ask? I'd like to be back behind some thick city walls as soon as possible. Filthy. Just the beginning. But then. But then. <laughs> This bard's tale begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seems just a few steps ahead. After many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima. It must suffice. Think of your cares if I'm clean. The gentleman will refer to His Imperial Majesty by his full title or not at all. The gentleman will be seated on the bergère. The what now? In that chair. Catwin. We shave the gentleman's sideburns to half an inch. Fine. Then what? Gonna do my nails too? If time permits. 
Sadly, the day is short. While the list of hygienic and cosmetic treatments that the gentleman should undergo is really rather long. Tilt your head back, please, and sit still. How goes it? Preparations for the audience proceeding as planned? Yes, General. The gentleman will be more or less presentable. Who's this guy? He a barber too? No. Morvran Voris, commander of the Albert Division. Yennefer's escort. They were my men, all of them. Indeed, were. For none have returned to Vizima, have they? I truly wonder what happened on the road yesterday. Perhaps you could enlighten me. You have time. And a uh, razor to your throat. Wild Hunt killed them. A cavalcade of wraiths dashing across the night sky. These omens of war the peasantry bubbles about. <laughs> Expect me to believe that. Frankly, I don't really give a damn. Nordlings, we can bathe you, shave you, and clothe you, but teaching you manners, that will be a challenge. Nice meeting you too. Done. Shall I shave him once more, against the grain? No. He himself is very much against the grain, that's enough. Farewell, Witcher. Or rather, see you soon. Good. Now the gentleman may dress. Sadly, I did not receive exact measurements. If the garments chafe, our tailor will adjust them. Black, black, or black. We do not like garish colors in Nilfgaard. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. A ready meal, directly out of Northern Tales. This might come as news to the gentleman. But a towel wrapped around one's waist is not fitting attire for an audience. The gentleman will kindly dress. This might come as news to the gentleman, but a towel wrapped around one's waist is not fitting attire for an audience. The gentleman will kindly dress.
Black suits the gentleman. Does the outfit satisfy the gentleman? A studded doublet and a sword on my back, that's what would satisfy me. But tough, when in Nilfgaard. Yes? It's a saying. So what now? Powder my nose? No need. The gentleman's complexion is light enough. The gentleman is to stand before the ruler of the North and South. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. Confirm away. Please watch. Leg extended. Hand flat. Head down. Chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. Gotta be kidding. Not at all. I am mortally serious. Does the gentleman know the penalty for breaches of etiquette in the Emperor's presence? 200 lashes. I do not wish that upon him, so I will not let him leave until I am confident that he knows how to behave. Please, this is neither the time nor the place for such antics. The gentleman will watch carefully. Leg extended, hand flat, head down, chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Once more. Leg extended, hand flat, head down, chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. Hmm, lacking fluidity and grace. But we've learned to expect less of Nordlings. Come with me. The gentleman will address the Emperor only when asked to and using the appropriate title. Your Arch Magnificency. I see the gentleman is in the mood for jests. I fear the Emperor might not share his disposition. Your Majesty will suffice. Spoken loudly, clearly, and with respect. In Grimmy at Arth Kerzer. Daithen Aden in Karn eb Marvut, Emir var Emreis. Bow. Your Imperial Majesty. Arer ep do orde. Avelian nomen vatgen favort. I thought you bowed before no man. Didn't want to disappoint the Chamberlain. We're friends. Take it you didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days, so... Silence. My daughter, Surila. She's returned. And she's in danger. The Wild Hunt pursues her. You will find her and bring her to me. How many men in your army? Twenty thousand? Thirty? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. She trusts me, yes. So tell me why you are looking for her. Doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. For reasons of state, as always. Enough of this banter. You will agree regardless. If for no other reason than because I shall pay you. More than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more. I need information, not motivation. 
Siri leaves few tracks. She'll be hard to find. My corps of spies will help you. Count on them and my army, should the need arise. Yennefer will tell you the rest. This audience is finished. Meririd! Take him to the sorceress. Follow me, if the gentleman pleases. Please keep close. There are many honorable guests in the palace, whom the gentleman... Disgusts. ...need not bother. And it's past noon. Calm yourself. What? Do you know who you're talking to, soldier? I'm Herevard II, Prince of Elanda. You've seen us for a moment. I'm made to wait yeah. here like some ah, suckers. Ah, no. Rad sleeten eh eh nicht. Es tun es ist sauer an den Fall. Kata ab. Es ist sieht ebsa. Gleiden. Es findet er nicht macht. Es ist so wat ge... 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 Schägen hat zu Wien. Es ist gleich nicht. Kein Weg drehen er da. Once the gentleman is done, he should see me to retrieve his possessions. Yes, then transcribe. The true authority at... Geralt, that tunic, you look positively smashing. Ugh, dying to take it off. I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. One I might even take you up on. But we've matters to attend to. Now do you understand why I'm at Amir's court? Mm-hmm. And seems we're in the same boat now. Siri, she's really back? No chance he's mistaken? Look, that's more or less what she looks like now. Or so our agents claim. Our little witch has grown into a young lady. How about that? She's grown up. It's been years since you trained together at Kaer Morn. A great deal has changed. You haven't. Not a bit. <laughs> I missed those awkward compliments of yours. But let's focus on Ciri, all right? Right. Amir said the Wild Hunt's after her. I'd find that hard to believe, before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Because of me. You see, I've spent months searching for Ciri. Using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the Wild Hunt might sense it, perhaps even find me, but... I thought I'd tricked them. Well, guess you were wrong. Hmm. I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me, for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. You must find her, Geralt. Before the Wild Hunt does. So where's Ciri been seen, exactly? In two places. Velen and Novigrad. The trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Ask for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's agents. He should get in touch with you. That's it? No passwords? Secret handshakes? None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the crafts of the trade. All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors, but there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. Triss Merigold. Apparently she's got a cozy flat on the main square. Sure she'll be delighted to see me. What about you? What will you do? I shall sail for Skellige. The... Guess this means we need to split up again. 
Not my preference, but I understand. Clock's ticking. It is indeed. So why don't I teleport you to Vell and get you there? Not gonna happen. I'll go on horseback. Soon Have it your way? Oh, and you really look quite dashing in black velvet. Think so? Maybe I can have some of my armor lined with it. <laughs> Good luck, Yen. Same to you. And if you wish to learn what happened in the world while you and Vesemir roamed the wilderness, talk to Ambas- And Geralt, I know it's wartime, but try not to be a hero, all right? Just check those leads and come back to me, in one piece. I shall be waiting. I serve the gentleman by returning my things. Citrus and cloves. The fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. Mm. Thanks, bunches. The emperor is not known for his patience. He wants his daughter back safe and sound as soon as possible. Yeah, mention something of the sort. So long. Nintamir Daytra. 